and sending a message of inclusion. This week, middle school students at Fairfield Intermediate will work together to make sure that every child feels accepted. It's part of a national campaign aimed at making a difference in the culture in our schools. And Local Trails Perry Shively is live inside the school today uh, with more on what's called No One Eats Alone. And I love the idea behind this, Perry. Yeah, I know, Sheila, it's such a neat program. You know, no one eats alone. The point is inclusion and that everyone, like you said, feels accepted. So this week here at Fairfield Intermediate School, they are really trying to drive that point home for these kids. Every day they're doing a different activity to kind of make them understand just how important this concept is. And one of the activities this week, they're going to have each kid sit at a different lunch table. Now, you know how we are. We all kind of get set in our ways. We want to sit with our friends. We go in the classroom. We sit in the same place. We go out to recess. We play with the same people or, you know, as adults, we do the same exact thing. So what they're trying to do is mix it up for these kids and kind of make them make new friends. And again, Again, make sure that everyone is accepted and again this is a national campaign and it started with parents who lost their children in the Sandy Hook mass shooting and so today with me here is Carrie O'Neill PTA president here at Fairfield Intermediate School tell us about why this program is so important for these kids um, there's a lot of lessons obviously that we learn in school you learn math science reading um, but just the lesson of being kind to one another and remembering to care about one another is a lesson that goes a long way in life. And it's nice to be able to focus on that for a week here at school and hopefully, hopefully that message will stick with them. And it's so interesting because these kids have that inherently. They just kind of, they, they know to do that. But again, it is a point because we do, we find our friends and then we kind of get set in our ways. So this is kind of forcing them out of their comfort zone. Right. Um, tomorrow during school, all the kids will be assigned a different color, like you mentioned. Um, and then they'll come to the cafeteria. There will be balloons on each table that coordinate to those colors. And there'll be some kind of get to know each other activities, meet somebody new and ask them some questions and, and hopefully kind of make some new friends along the way. And then also today they're going to be wearing green in memory of those victims of Sandy Hook. So they're also going to come in here. They're going to have a tablecloth that they can write some positive messages to each other. So great things going on here at Fairfield Intermediate School. Guys, back to you. And who knows what a difference that might make for, for a child or two. Perry, yeah. thank you. National No One Eats Alone Day is this Friday.